This Amazonian tribe inspired the latest high-end collection by the Brazilian sportswear brand, Osclin. Is it inspiring or is it exploitative? It is, in the strictest sense, cultural appropriation. The term is caught fire online as a way to shame creators who borrow from cultures other than their own, often in pretty insensitive, sometimes even racist ways. But borrowing in itself is not a bad thing. Evaluating Oscar's work, there really is tremendous transformation. Uh, we can say, here we have an artist, not merely a cultural tourist or a collector. Susan Scafidi literally wrote the book on cultural appropriation. She says that Osclin is showing a model of how it could be done right. If I do a project, there must be something common, sharing values, sharing vision, sharing the economics, sharing, sharing things. Metzavad is a UNESCO ambassador who's had a relationship with the Ashaninka tribe in the Amazon for years. He's helped build a school, befriended their shaman, and even designed a new logo for them. On his recent visit, he emerged with concepts for his 2016 spring fashion line. He didn't copy designs, but he was inspired by them. That red of their tattoos, it's a beautiful red. Things that seduce me and make me in an emotional way, they create a red image in my mind. At the business end, Osclin's new collection is structured the way many artist collaborations are. The tribe will receive royalties from sales of the clothes. I think it was a great balanced world between us. It's not fair to ask any culture to freeze itself in time and live as though they were a museum diorama. Culture is fluid, culture evolves, but it should go both ways with respect. When cultural appropriation is done right, everyone can benefit. One of the Ashaninka leaders said that Osclin's collection helped share their environmental message with a much wider audience. In modern global society, we're often exposed to all kinds of cultures. That's something to celebrate. It's often the way great art happens. It would be a huge mistake to shut that out. I was in the Amazon, I had that experience. A metaphysical experience and a cultural experience. Those things get embedded in you. This is the magic of style. It's the magic of art. It's the magic of the design.